Qatari Prime Minister is saying um, that it follows the Paris Conference, as they're calling it. So it was a meeting of uh, American, Israeli, Qatari and Egyptian leaders. Uh, and they all got on the same page for what they think the deal should look like. Now they're taking it to Hamas and what they think the, de the deal should look like from leaks that we know or that we have is uh, a, a six to eight week, but let's start with a six week pause in the fighting. And after that, a release of hostages in stages. Um, and that sort of mimics the earlier deal, but a release of many more uh, Palestinian prisoners in return for the hostages in this round. Uh, we have just heard from Hamas tonight, a spokesperson for Ismail Haniyeh, the Hamas chief, um, of course, the external chief, not Yahya Sunwar inside Gaza. And he says that they don't want any short-term pause. They want the fighting to end, not just a ceasefire, an actual end of fighting uh, with no return. And then once the Israelis leave the Gaza Strip, then they will discuss the details. So that's not as optimistic as what we've just heard from the Qatari Prime Minister. And I must say, uh, that was the tone in Jerusalem from the Prime Minister of Israel earlier, when he was also saying, you know, the tone in Washington and the tone from the Qatari Prime Minister is optimistic but the tone from the party is slightly less so, I have to say, tonight as well.